Hi, my name is Charles and I'm one of the maths teachers from the Maxim Workshop. I'm just going to now teach you how to do some math. Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how to calculate cubic metres. Now cubic metres is a measurement that's used for volume. Now the easiest example that I can show you is when you look at um, a shape with a length, a width and a height. Now, and the basic um, shape that has all three is your cube. Indeed, you could draw a rectangle, cuboid, um, but for this purpose, it will be easy to show you how these measurements relate. So, I mean, with your cube, it's interesting to see that um, it's just like a square, but in 3D. So, if you have any one side as four, then all other sides have the same value. So, four, four, four. So this would be your length, this would be your width, and this would be your height. Let's put those in brackets. Now the units that we're going to use for this is centimetres. But um, I'm going to show you obviously how to change from centimetres to cubic metres. Okay? So first of all we want to change these measurements into um, a value for the volume in centimetre cubed, okay? So we have um, your four centimetres, if we want to change that into metres, then all we have to do is divide by 10, okay? So where we had four centimetres, we now have 0 0.4 metres, okay? So all it is, is a division of 10 to go from there to there. So all we need to do now is change all of these to 0 0.4 meters. Okay, now your basic volume equation is length times width times height, okay? So if we take all of our um, variables here and substitute them in, we have 0 0.4 times 0 0.4 times 0 0.4. Now all you have to do here is just think about what 4 times 4 times 4 is and then bring in the zeros afterwards. So we have 4 times 4 is 16 and times another 4 is 64. So 4 cubed is 64. Now all we have to do is just divide that by 100, sorry 1000 because we have 3 div divisions by 10 here. And that means that we take the decimal point over three times. So we're going to need 0 0.064 meters cubed. Now remember, this is your measurement for volume in cubic meters. First thing I done here was obviously calibrate from my four centimeter measurement to my 0 0.4 meter cubed, sorry, meters measurement. So those were for the lengths. And then afterwards, I inserted all of these values into the equation here, and then just multiplied them together. And then this gave me a value of 0 0.064 meter cubes. And that's basically how to calculate cubic meters.